yes. the first lady, Michelle Obama. Yes, you know her well. I do. But you have a very exciting first with our former first. <sighs> Yeah. You were the first major interview for her book, Becoming. She went there in the book, and she was talking about things that she has never intensely talked... Intensely personal. Intensely personal, and things that people have... Um, a lot of couples have dealt with, and that's fertility. That's what I mean about putting yourself out there, you know? I think it makes people uh, feel like they can trust you when you're, when you're mm -hmm. that kind of naked, you yeah. know what I mean? Emotionally, she put herself out Vulnerable there. Vulnerable and authentic were like you that. Like, Wow, I, I didn't uh, expect her to go uh, there? No, I did not. Uh, I know that she had written about it in the book and didn't expect her to go to, to the degree that she did. And I asked her, I said, well, what helped you get through that? And, and she said, there's nothing really anybody can say, because I said, does someone say that to her? But she said, she's got this, and I love looking at it, your big, great audience, and there's, there's a circle, this, this, this council of girlfriends. Yeah. And she said when she was talking to her friends, and they would go like, I had a miscarriage too. That happened to me too. Right, right me too. Right. And, and no one really had talked about it. And so she is bringing it out to the forefront. And it's very important to her um, to get the word out that we shouldn't be whispering about something like that. The fact that all she's ever wanted to do and still wants to do is make a difference. It's just make a difference. It's just to, to raise her hand and say, you know, this is how I did it. I'm going to leave some clues for you. And I want you to reach every single goal that you have for yourself. That's all she's ever wanted.